Welcome back to Toasted Gaming Channel. As always, my mission is to play every FPS game ever made. Right now we are in 93 and we have a game called Ken's Labyrinth. Do you know who's Ken? I think I do. <laughs> Can you stop the game? That's the Ken. That's the Ken we're looking for. Ken Silverman. Legendary man. You don't know about him? Wait till I tell you. So yeah, it's his first, and from what I got, his only game. Don't touch me. Entering floor 1, volume 1. Once upon a time, we won't read this, we don't have time. We have to play the game. So, so like I said, 93. In 93, we got games like Doom, original one, and Blakestone, and we don't care about any other games. And, well, we got this little game called Ken's Labyrinth, made by Ken... Silverman, yes, he named the game after himself. He was that kind of man, I guess. Um, also, it's his labyrinth, he made it. Cool, just look at this. What does it remind of? Guys, it is a video game? Hmm? It started with D? Oh, you don't know. Well, you'll know by the time we end playing. Stop ending. Stop playing this game. Why I can't talk? What the hell? That's not fair. Stop. Um, okay, so, like I said, 93. The game was developed by Ken alone. He also made the engine. And he also published the game himself, I think. At least that was, that's what the internet says. I think this was probably a shareware game. So, you know, Ken gave away first episode and then... If you wanted second, third and so on episodes, well, you had to pay the money. Just like in Doom, or Wolfenstein, or every other DOS game from that time. Uh, so, yeah, Ken, Ken Silverman, we all know him best for... You probably said the right answer, but maybe you didn't, so I'll just say it myself. He made the build engine. Yup! I think this is like a very early build engine game. That's why we got to interact with that water canister or whatever it was, water, sink, insert key. And so, it's original game. Yeah, it's original game. Except in 2002 he ported it from... Thank you, Ken. Except in 2002... That's cool music, I like this music. Uh, in 2002 he ported Ken's Labyrinth to PC. Before that it was just for... DOS. And so, yeah, like I said, he made the legendary build engine, which later on was very important in FPS gaming. At first, with... At first, this engine was used for William Shatner's Tech War, and that game is awful. I never played it from what I've seen. I wish I would never have to, but since my mission is to play every FPS game ever made, I'll have to play it too, so... It sucks, but, you know. But after that, that same engine was used for... For Duke Nukem 3D. That was the D game that I asked you about. He also... Well, not he, but... I mean, build engine was also used later for Shadow Warrior. For... Blood. And there were a few other games, like Nam And World War 2 GI. But you guys, you don't know those games, so it doesn't matter. And maybe... Original Prey was supposed to use it? No, I think that was a bit after. A bit later, so no. Shoot this wall, thank you, Ken. Thank you. Um, yeah, what else? I think he worked in some company later on, some bigger gaming company for a bit, from what I can remember. So he helped with some other games. If Ken is watching this video, thank you for what you did to FPS Gaming. Um, and, you know, if he worked on any other FPS games after Ken's Labyrinth, we'll get to see them. Because like I said, I'll play every FPS game ever made, that's my mission. Um, yeah, what else? Oh, so, this, this is very important in all of those videos I tell you the way I'm playing this game. So, obviously I'm playing on Windows, because that's... That's the only way to play. Well, you can play on DOS, but I mean, wait. Okay, so it was released for DOS, but I guess it 
it's an official source port because what I'm playing is called a source port and it was it on Ken's official website I don't know just guys look for Ken's Labyrinth source port there's only one and it's this one you don't even need to own the game you just get that source port you click on the icon and that's it you start the game it's easy like that and then you can enjoy this so if this is exactly how the game looked back in 93 you know except i'm playing on higher resolution but except for resolution it looked like this back in 93 it's a pretty good looking game i mean have you seen guys other games from 93 i played Isle of the dead now that's the worst looking game ever probably and I'll play so many other FPS games from 93 and 94 that will have graphics so ugly that you're gonna want to come back to Ken's Labyrinth. Okay, I haven't been here yet. What? Ouch! Is that Ken voicing the main character? Just die! Oh my god, I might not survive! Let's run away! I heal with apples. How do I? Oh my god, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die. No, 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 no. <sighs> Maybe I can't kill it? It says that I have different weapon. No, it doesn't say that. <laughs> um, I'm having a bit of fun, music is pretty good, you know. Action is, I mean, what you would expect from 93 shooter. I mean, I... What? I jumped into that hole for a reason. I thought it was a way that leads me somewhere. But yeah, one of the better FPS games from 93. Oh, I also think that this game was published by Epic Mega Games. I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry, Ken. I didn't mean to disappoint you like that. But I think... Is that possible? Ouch, 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 stop killing me. I'm not doing that. Because I feel like I saw Epic Mega Games logo, but that doesn't make any sense. No, it can be. I take back what I said, I doubt that. I don't even know why did I think it was. I mean, on official website it says it was made by Advanced Systems and published by Advanced Systems. So... Well... Unless it was just PC version that was made and published by Advanced Mega Systems. Advanced Systems. Because, I mean, this version that I'm playing, it was published by Advanced Systems, the PC one. But I don't know about DOS version. So, I don't know. I don't know. I should dig more before I play the game. i never seen anyone review this game. None of the more popular YouTubers ever said anything about it. I wonder why. I mean, I've seen reviews about games like I Slow the Death or I Slow the Dead. Or Corridor 7 and those other games made by Pinnacle of Entertainment. <laughs> Thanks to CV. Uh, yeah, I think, I think, can someone kill me? Yeah, game over. So Ken's Labyrinth, it's free. Thank you, Ken Silverman. Look, he's back. He looks like he's 16 years old here. Could that be true? Who knows, maybe. Um... There's different chapters, different episodes, so guys, if you want, type in Ken's Labyrinth, Source, so, Source, Source Port, or something like that in Google, and you'll find it. It's worth trying, I'd say. So, thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you on another FPS game. Goodbye.